The University of Massachusetts Amherst is seeing some big changes and with the new chancellor in place, the school will likely be looking to raise its profile. But what will that mean in a different name? ABC 40's Kathy Reynolds joins us live now with the details. Kathy. Sabrina, that new chancellor, Robert Holub, comes here from the University of Tennessee, Knoxville. But we're pretty sure he knows that other public schools like UConn and the University of Michigan rarely make reference to the towns they're located in. So will the University of Massachusetts Amherst change its name to fit in? It may be dark out, but the words clearly spell out an identity crisis. Is this campus the University of Massachusetts Amherst or UMass? When I describe the school, I call it just UMass. Tom Birmingham's a senior marketing major who points out the school promotes both. The web address is UMass, the logo, the University of Massachusetts Amherst. Alumni were and are UMass. This one just says UMass Amherst. And this one says just UMass. But what's in a name? According to marketing firm co-owner Marsha Montori, everything. Well, from a branding standpoint, I, I think you want your name and, and, and your brand really to speak to everybody who, for whom it's meaningful. Montori doesn't work with the University of Massachusetts Amherst, but thinks this growing research institution with five state locations would be wise to take the town out of its name. If I'm not at Amherst, I'm getting, what, a different degree? It could be costly for them to change all the signs and everything. Tom's advice? Keep it simple. Hitting the books here is hard enough. Well, the school has changed its name several times since it was started as the Massachusetts Agricultural College back in 1863. The last time, though, was 14 years ago. A university spokesperson says there are no plans to change the name at this time. Sabrina.